All right, there's a little secret under here. I know it's not a Marshall JCM 2000, is it? No, it's not. Nor is it this delay pedal. Are you confused yet? Okay, it is the Emo Amp. I don't know, the upside down devil fork stake, but you know, it's the cheapest um, attenuator. And Donner, this is a Donner uh, delay pedal, digital and analog. I've had nothing but good luck with Donner. And this amp is 100 watts a tube. It's louder than freaking sax. It's it's louder than my... I typically have it running like there-ish, if not lower. That's a problemo, because everyone says, you got to push it to four to sound like anything. You got to... Yeah, not true, buddy. Sorry. <laughs> I've pushed it up to two. And uh, everyone's eardrums bleed, so... Let's just chill out about the whole you got to go to four thing, all right? Because I'm not buying it. And right now we're unboxing the Donner. Uh, freaking Emo Mini. <laughs> uh, by unboxing, I just mean opening the freaking lid and then just doing that. Why is it Emo, though? I like that, though. I like Emo. I gotta move this goes back here in the effects this goes back here somewhere in the uh effects loop by the way can i just say i love the burnt orange texas where you at I love, I, I, the burnt orange i don't have a pedal that is burnt orange yet i mean you see what i'm saying you starting to see what i'm saying This is some up close. This is like Discovery Channel going underseas. You're seeing some up close. I like emo people. I'm not saying I don't like you guys. I'm just saying, why is this the emo amp controller? It's just an. It's an attenuator. It's, pa it's up there. Passive. Passive attenuator. Since it is passive, you don't need this power supply that just um, gives you the LED so let's take that off the LED won't work and now I dropped it I'm never gonna find it again and I lost my digital delay this is great this is great Donner all right so I put my little attenuator emo boy down here you got the volume at one maxed out so it's not even being this is not even being used really <laughs> like two and a third or whatever. We're gonna go up to four, which is insane. This is, I'm not gonna do it up to here. You can hear the hissing. It's... I thought, that's what I thought. You're gonna kill somebody doing that, so. Let me know if this sounds any better. Wow, my heart's racing from that. Level 4 is insane. I saw someone on YouTube saying that I love, by the way. He said, um, the JCM is so much louder. This thing has to be 4 and above. No, it doesn't. <laughs> so, okay, so we're going to start off volume 1, and this thing is off. And by that, I mean it's maxed out, which means it's letting all of the volume through it. So that's off. <laughs> substantial leap. Wow. We're going to go up 
to level three, which is insane. <laughs> Attenuated. Let's go insane. We're going up to volume like six ish. Does it sound any better? I don't think so whatsoever, actually. <laughs> out and you tell me if this um, putting the volume up made such an incredible difference that people say it does <laughs> only $32 <laughs> instead of wasting um, hundreds on the other attenuators. Yeah, that ain't gonna work. Let's attenuate, shall we? not going to use this so uh in conclusion oh i was closer to two by the way in conclusiono yeah life is terrible but also uh, um in addition to that um i believe from what i heard well we'll go through the footage footage how old am i uh freaking we'll go through the uh, tape tape it's not we're gonna go through the video i think level between one and two not attenuated sounds way better than something at four that's you know what though? Maybe it's because I bought a $32 pedal that just kind of hit me like a ton of bricks. We'll see. We'll have to ask somebody who has more money and is willing to spend more than $32 on an Emo amp controller. But um, I'm not impressed with this. It works. It works 100%. Okay, and I can plug it in and show you that the LED works. It's just that. Do you need it? So when you do that, it just mutes, you know, but I have a hard time believing that anything else is going to throttle an amp and sound and sound good. Um, and the reason why I say that is because I have other Donner pedals. I have a Donner delay pedal that's just the most beautiful digital. It's got a bunch of options on there, digital and analog. A Donner EBY switcher to switch between two amps. It's flawless. Got a Donner noise gate killer it's, that's been on the whole time. And you get, uh, it's just a noise gate. It's flawless. So I doubt that the problem is that it's Donner because they're incredible and they're somehow wicked affordable. But by the way, this was the guitar I was using, the Bridge EMG uh, Schecter. And no, I'm not done with my video because I know that I'm going to get a complaint already. All you did was negative Z drop metal, so attenuation could be done with rock. Okay, first of all, it was a drop, I think, B. Okay, but I'm going to go to a standard tuning, fine. Standard tuning, uh, 
Seymour Duncan Invader pick up, which is very midi in um, rock. Volume 1, turned the game down, obviously. I hooked up the Donner Delay pedal in series, both to show you that they're quality pedals. Let's just see if attenuating a rock tone at 4 uh, sounds better than just a raw tone at 1. Yeah, I'm not going to be in tune. Just deal with it, because i got to redo wiring to get my tuner pedal in. Attenuate. I know it should be around noon if I'm gonna bump this shit up. Sorry, to three ish, four ish. Here it is, attenuated. Should sound a lot better, right? <laughs> guys keep that in mind according to everyone you're supposed to push the marshal to four i'll go five to make you happier you know attenuate the hell out of it it's just not working guys <laughs> You might think, oh, that sounds great. Well, okay, well then we'll just pretend like that thing is not working and we'll do the amp really loud. I mean, <laughs> So we got a winner there. So I was saying it's not a Donner problem. It's a uh, why would you want to throttle your amps 